Uh, good morning, Mr. and Mrs. Customer. Thank you for inquiring on our 2010 Hyundai Santa Fe with 36,000 miles. Uh, we have it listed at 23.9, which is very competitive uh, pricing as far as this car being certified. Um, and with this Hyundai being certified, uh, the benefits to you is that you're going to get the remaining balance of Hyundai's warranty um, rather than it not being certified. You're going to get the remainder of the five year 60,000, that's bumper to bumper, everything on the vehicle. Uh, you get the remaining balance of the 10 year 100,000 mile powertrain that covers all the major lubricated parts on your engine, the transmission, and the drive axle. Um, on top of that, you'll also get an additional five years of roadside assistance. So you're getting 10 years unlimited mile roadside assistance. Um, and it does cover flat tires, lockouts, jump starts, gasoline replenishment, as well as towing. Okay, um, but this vehicle here is a 2010. Um, and what I'm going to do now is, is show you all the features on the car. And as you can see on the front of the vehicle, this vehicle is equipped with daytime running lights as well as the front fog lights also. Um, the vehicle has 18 inch alloy wheels. Okay, it does come equipped with a luggage rack as well as a tow package on the back. The antenna there is for your satellite XM radio. As we go into the vehicle, the back doors are equipped with a child safety lock that can be engaged and disengaged from this button here. But as you enter into the vehicle, each this vehicle comes equipped with power windows, power locks, and power mirrors. Okay, it does have a power seat. It's an eight-way adjustable power seat. Uh, it does give you lumbar support as well. Um, this vehicle can be elevated. It can be moved back and forth as, in, as well as reclining you. The car is equipped with, if you can see it here, this button here is your electronic stability control. And that feature, it actually is, a, is an excellent safety feature. It controls as far as when you lose control of the car, it'll, uh, it'll assist you in braking. It'll reduce the throttle on the car and it distributes power evenly to the axles in order to help you gain control of the car and keep it on its intended path. As we look further into the vehicle, you will see on the steering column, you have audio controls here that control the mode, the volume, and the station, all right, as well as your cruise control and your Bluetooth. You can make calls, take calls, and hang up calls. Um, that's where your speaker would be above your head in order to, uh, it's your microphone for the Bluetooth and you would hear everything through the speakers like you would the audio when you're listening to a call. Um, but this vehicle is equipped with navigation and a backup camera. All right. Also, if you can see here, you have dual climate controls for the driver and the passenger so that each person can control their temperature. Um, once we get the radio going here, I'll show you. The vehicle is XM radio capable. Once again, it does have navigation. It is touch screen. As you can see, you do have navigation on the vehicle, as well as a backup camera. And as you see those lines there, the green, yellow, and the red, uh, it will beep as you get closer into the red area as you're backing up into, as you're backing the vehicle up. Um, as you can see your digital clock there, 
your defrosters, as well as your emergency light. The vehicle is also equipped, if you can see it, it has USB iPod plug-ins, which in a 2010 up until the current year model, Hyundai has made that a standard feature on their vehicles. As we go around the vehicle, it has plenty of cargo space in the back. And as you can see, I've already had one of the, uh, it's a 60-40 fold down on the back seat. So you can still carry in a third person if you needed to put longer items into this vehicle. This particular model, this Santa Fe, has all the equipment that's available that you can get on one of these. But as you can see, there's also an AC plug-in as well as an extra power outlet in the back. AC plug-in would be good for, you know, those electronic uh, or the coolers that you can plug in. Is And there is a button up in the front where you can turn on and off the AC plug-in. Now, if you were to look, as you can see, it does come with all the mats this area here is where all of the jack as well as your plugs your wheel locks all right um, but you do have an extra storage compartment area that is very big that you can store the things as you can see there's a cargo net this is just extra storage for you But once again, just to give you a shot of the back seat, which is a 60-40 split. And finally, it's a, this is a 3.5 liter V6 engine. Uh, the estimated fuel economy on it is 20 around town, 26 uh, on the highway. So your combined is roughly about 23, 24. Um, but as you can see, everything's very accessible. Your windshield wiper fluid is here. Changing the oil and checking the oil. and the battery as well as your brake fluid and that's pretty much everything on the vehicle once again this vehicle is uh, competitively priced at $23.9 when you do make it to the dealership make sure you ask for me John Faheron Alan Turner Hyundai